A senior rebel leader named Amaru has been captured by the cartel. Interrogate a Santa Blanca lieutenant for Amaru's location, then go and extract him. Time to earn your pay, people. Put on your game faces. I tell you, I'm not too comfortable working with Pakatari and these rebels. Their kind of ideology always ends up with more bodies in the ground. What's your feeling on this op, Nomad? End of the day, this is a revenge mission. We need to focus and get this done quick before we get stuck between local politics and the firestorm of cartel bullets. First objective, track down that Santa Blanca lieutenant so we can find Amaru. Whoa. Tired by another... Don't want to spook the target. Switch to suppressors. Enemy activity. Stay sharp. Got eyes on the target. Let's move. Drone is airborne. I got a target carrying submachine guns. I got a third. Get in position. Ready to engage. Moving to position. I'm moving to position. Good to go. Engaging. Damn, that sure got his attention. Okay, we're still good. Careful, Sicario sporting a submachine gun next to the sandbag emplacement. Back it up, back it up. We rattled somebody's cage. That was fucking come Pinche cabron. Está bien, ganaron. Ya está. Puta madre. Ya está. Te entrego las armas. Here's the deal, asshole. You answer my questions, or I put a bullet in your gut and leave you to die in your own shit. No entiendes? Chill the fuck out, cabrón. What do you want? Amaru. Where can I find him? <laughs> you serious? That's what this is about? Sure thing. He's at Atoya Farm. Go on. Then you can see what we do to people who fuck with us. People like you. We need to get this done in a hurry. Amaru's an old man. He's not gonna last long under torture. Shit, if they've been working on him for a while, there's a good chance he's already dead. Maybe, maybe not. Amaru's a major player in the rebel movement. The cartel will keep him alive as long as they can to find out what he knows. We can't afford to take any chances. There's too much riding on this. Let's move. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up the supplies later. Let's get moving. The cartel isn't gonna wait around for us to track down and rescue Amaru.
Buckle up, people. Sicarios are ex-military. ID your targets. If Amaru gets killed by a stray round, Operation Kingslayer will be dead in the water before it even starts. Let's go. Tango number three. He makes five. Target marked. Keep an eye on your background. Hold up. They're gonna spot you. I got a Sicario over here. Where you got him? In the barn. Ready. Call the shot. Got it. They're gonna see you. Hold up. Chale, cierren el pico. Aquí hay algo raro. Moving to position. Say the word. I have a shot. Engaging. Are you Amaru? What's left of him anyway? Come on, we're getting you out of here. I got it, I'll fly. Back to your friends. Entonces Pacatari has made his deal with the malditos extranjeros, the young fool. Take it up with him, senor.
Hold on. I've been wanting one of these. is not the most gracious of hosts. These Aucas, these demons, they had questioning me. Let us say their talk of love was enough to make me vomit. But their methods were not... were not... Were their names Yuri and Polito? Si, Yuri Polito. These are the fucks that tortured Ricky Sandoval while Sueño questioned him. I want them bad. We only saw run-of-the-mill Sicarios when we freed Amaru. But I haven't seen Yuri and Polito in at least three days, maybe four. I don't know where they are now. We need more intel. We'll search every village and camp until we find something. Somebody's gotta know something. Gather documents, hack computers, interrogate hostile lieutenants, talk to civvies, whatever it takes. We'll turn over every rock. Heads up. Bowman's file on Yuri and Polito is coming through. There were four people in the room the night DEA agent Ricky Sandoval was murdered. El Sueño, the head of the Santa Blanca cartel, Ricky, and the last two were La Yuri and El Polito. Yuri and Polito met at a poor state-run hospital in Chiapas, where El Polito was doing his residency, and La Yuri worked as a nurse. It was love at first sight. From the first moment their eyes met, they were inseparable. A love like no other. One day, a Buchan named La Plaga walked into the ER, all shot up. It was touch and go for a while, but Yuri and Polito were able to save his life. La Plaga was grateful. He showered them with gifts, invitations to the most exclusive parties, even a new car. And after a while, La Plaga made Yuri and Polito the personal medical staff of the Santa Blanca cartel. But that wasn't their main job. See, Yuri and Polito know about the human body. They know how much pain a person can endure before he'll die. They know how to keep a person alive and awake so they can feel the pain. And most of all, they know how to inflict that pain. That's what they do in Itaqua province. When Santa Blanca captures someone that refuses to talk, La Yuri and El Polito make them talk. They break people. Like I said, there were four people in the room the night Ricky Sandoval was murdered. Sueño, Ricky, Yuri, and Polito. They kept Ricky alive while Sueño tortured him. Non-stop, for 47 hours straight, they broke Ricky Sandoval, then Sueño executed him. Pakatari's rebel movement is on the verge of defeat. If we help him turn things around, we'll be able to count on his support in the future. Running away. 
Escort vehicle destroyed. Ah oh, shit, we've been spotted. Escort vehicle destroyed. Ah oh, shit, we've Escort destroyed. This is the garage. Sound off if you spot Polito's car. Roger that. Tomo gear's in good shape. We'll pass on the location of the truck to the Rebels. Well done, compadres. My speech was heard all over Bolivia. It is only a matter of time before the people rise up and join our cause. Viva la revolución! Glad we could help. Now what have you got on Yuri and Polito? Nothing yet, amigo. Those two, they cover their tracks well. But my people are working on it. We will know something soon. In the meantime, my revolutionary brothers in Itaqua stand ready to help if you need them. Just call, and they will come. I'll keep that in mind. Someone who can give you information on Yuri and Polito. I'm listening. One of my lieutenants managed to escape from them. He fled to a village called Kulta. Rather than give my man up to the cartel, the villagers hid him. Goddamn bravery right there. In response, Santa Blanca raised every home and executed all the villagers. Fuck. My lieutenant is still being kept alive. Probably so he can be killed in an even more painful way. Understood. We're heading to Kulta now. A captured rebel being held in the village of Colta might have valuable intel on Liuri and El Polito. Rescue him from the cartel and find out what he knows. Looks like Kulta is still smoldering. Keep an eye out for the rebel they've got held here. Yo, we got hostiles. We got a Sicario. Next to the church. Deploying drone. Got another tango. I got a third target.
I got a narco over here. The church. Inside. That makes five. Just spotted one with submachine guns. We got a Sicario, next to the church. Yo, two cartel gunmen, next to the church. That's ten targets. I got a narco over here. Tell me where. Next to the church. We're up to fifteen. We're still good. I'm getting a position. Ready to fire. Dropped him. That was close. Hang back, 
that guy just switched on. Must have heard the gunshot. Roger, let me get in position. Say the word, boss. Engaging tango. Assholes know we're here. Hey, Stay hey, quiet. abre la puerta, compa. Open the door. We're clear over here. God, these fuckers are sloppy. You okay, hermano? What do you want from me? Yuri and Polito, the fuckers who tortured you. We're here to make them pay for what they did. But we need to know where they took you. We didn't travel far. I... I remember that much, and it was quiet. Out in the country somewhere. There... There, there was a smell, like old animal skins. That's all I know. I... I'm sorry. It's all right. At least now we know they're close by. Gracias. We've got a location on El Polito's personal car. Steal it, so our techs can analyze the car's GPS for intel. activity nearby. The drone is up. Tango on the roof. Tango on the roof. Hey, we got a narco next to that crate of calm gear. Watch your fire. We don't want to hit any civilians. We got a Sicario. Ready, call the shot. Opening fire. Tango is fucking down. Fuck, they're coming right at us. Balls. Take cover already.
Grenade, move, move, move. Grenade, move. Good to go. There it is. Eyes on Polito's car. This car is swanky. And there's a bloody condom in the glove box. Make that two bloody condoms. I guess that confirms it's Yuri and Polito's ride. Even if the condoms come standard, it's a sweet fucking car. I never could understand an arc like that. You get an expensive whip, put chrome rims on it, then you just drive it around the same dusty towns you were driving around before. You totally want one of these cars, don't you? Fancy car, fancy suit, still the same street, so what's the point? Air conditioning. Check the car's GPS for locations where Yuri and Polito may be hiding out. We've learned that an Unidad captain named Fuentes has been working with Yuri and Polito. Interrogate Fuentes and see what intel he can give us. Eyes on an Unidad grunt. Okay, this is the Unidad Firebase. We're looking for the captain who's in contact with Yuri and Polito. We need the target alive. Roger that. Well, Here we go. Got it. Eyes on the Unidad captain. Sniper up in the tower. I got eyes on a generator. He makes five.
motherfucker knows somebody's gunning for him now. I have a shot. Engage him. Sniper, top of the tower. that local. Detainees again. Get that quieto. What the hell is this? How's it going, fuckstick? You are dead. <clears throat> Mierda. You may as well kill me now. I'm not talking, carajo. Well, that's your choice. But with a pair of sick fucks like Yuri and Polito, one day that might be you hanging from their ceiling. You can't trust them. It would be a relief if I took them out of your life. Look, I'm not a snitch, but let's just say, yeah, they freak me out. The thing is, they're not even in Itaqua. So call them back to Itaqua. Tell them you've got a package ready. Uh. Oye, Olito. I got a lamb ready for delivery. Un borrego. Vale. got a 20 on Yuri and Polito. The activity cross-referenced the car's GPS with that description you got from the prisoner. They're at a hunting lodge. Rumor has it they use that spot for their enhanced interrogation. Send us the location and we'll take care of it. Put them in the ground for me. Make sure they feel the pain. <laughs> Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on. We've got a location on Liuri and El Polito. Let's pay these fuckers back for what they did to Sandoval. I don't care how you do it, so long as they both end up dead. Advance on the lodge. Stay alert. Shit, we got company.
Move in. Watch those doorways and corners. This must be where Sandoval cashed in. Bowman said they kept him alive for 47 hours. Tough son of a bitch held out for a long time. I feel like he was waiting for us to come get him and we're real fucking late. Time to make it right. Cariño, who were you before you met me? Mamacita, I was nobody. Nothing. I could not have even imagined a life so deep, a love so full as the love I have with you. God, I feel the same. I was half a person before I met you. I was a faded image, out of focus, until I could see myself through your eyes. Then, just now when I was breaking that man's hands, I was imagining that he had tried to touch you. Come on, you're such a jealous man. And each finger I broke was punishment for a sin those hands had committed against you. Gordo, you're going to make me cry. I have... I have a confession. You know you can tell me anything. Anything at all. Before, when you drenched that man with water and I was electrocuting him with a cattle prod? But, Mirina, that was textbook perfection. Let me speak. After that man had defecated himself because all the pain we had put him through, the suffering, <laughs> a passion like Christ, when he was lying there whimpering, I almost felt pity for him. I wanted to take care of him, to wrap my arms around him, to wipe away his tears. Yuri, look at me. What are you trying to tell me? Amor, I want to have a baby. Yuri and Polito have been terminated. You know how in the movies people always act like revenge isn't satisfying? Like it doesn't make them feel any better? Sure. Well, I feel fucking great. Taking out that lovey-dovey horror show also earned us some points with the locals. Make contact when you find something new. Bowman out. Yuri is down. 